we really want landholders to continue to um, notify local land services of any damage um, that, they've, uh, uh, that they've had through this flood event um, by calling the 1300 number um, and reporting that to us. Uh, that way we're able to certainly uh, collate that data and uh, get the situation, really get a good hold of the situation in our region. Uh, we're up to just on 187 reports from landholders um, and that uh, ranges from damage, damage reports and also uh, reports uh, for uh, or requests for assistance uh, to help with livestock and to locate livestock and also help with uh, feeding if required. So for those landholders in Forbes and downstream towards Condobolin, we're certainly urging to uh, certainly keep an eye out for their stock, monitor the situation and ensure that their stock are in high ground. Um, the preparedness is really important for those, uh, for those landholders to be prepared for that water. Um, so far, landholders have done a fantastic job with being prepared and we'd like to urge landholders to continue that uh, downstream. We've covered uh, a million hectares now in surveillance, uh, assisting landholders uh, uh, for looking for livestock and also looking at damage assessment across the region um, and getting that information uh, back to the control centre so they can start collating uh, some of the effects that this, uh, this event has had. It's been very pleasing um, from the Central West LLS perspective that most landholders have been very, very prepared for this event, um, certainly been able to uh, move stock to higher ground and uh, we certainly uh, applaud landholders for the action that they've taken. Um, it certainly uh, made it a lot easier for themselves um, to, to really make sure that they stay safe during and their livestock are safe during this event. We've got staff at Ningen and Forbes carrying out operations there for the Ag and Animal Services functional area. Following up um, uh, those requests from landholders for assistance, so we're looking at carrying out surveillance, uh, looking for livestock and helping those uh, landholders locate those livestock, uh, and then working with those landholders to come up with options to uh, either move the stock or uh, look at uh, providing fodder for those stock. So landholders have been doing a fantastic job at uh, getting uh, support for themselves and getting uh, their stock moved and getting their stock fed.